This is actually on the floor of the aquarium. It's a sandbar shark. You guys, this is Hope with the delicious soaps and gifts. Coming to you with a lunchtime chronicles. What's going on, people? It seems like it's been forever and a day since I had a chance to do lunchtime chronicles. Whew, a lot's happened. I've already eaten my lunch because I needed this time to designate to you all to try to keep you up to date as far as what's happened from last time that I posted to now. So let me try to backtrack. Um, today's Friday. Week was kind of uneventful. Mr. had a little mini stroke. He's okay now. Um, excuse me. Um, so last Saturday, so I didn't post, I think, probably Wednesday and Friday. I might be really, really behind. So I tried to get some overtime in because I knew that um, I was going to need the money, right? And also because I need the money, right? So anyway, um, Saturday... I met up with my friend, Nikki. She and I have known each other for 40 plus years, 40 plus years. Went to Mississippi, uh, spent the day with each other, and um, we went to the beach. Even though it was late in the day, it wasn't bad, it wasn't really cold. Um, a little cool, but not cold. It wasn't rainy, it was the uh, the sun was out still so we were able to actually enjoy um, the beach for a little bit so then after that uh, we had dinner we went out to dinner and I'm gonna try to post some uh, pictures of us at the beach and then we went to dinner I think I took pictures of what we had we had this amazing avocado appetizer it had um, tuna it's like a sushi type tuna and had a sauce on there that was ah, it was a reduction of um, soy sauce and brown sugar but you guys oh my goodness it's so so good the avocados were perfectly ripe it was on point what I had I had some Mawi Mawi I wasn't impressed at all but it was still good I still ate it Let's see. So later on, we went home, went home, went back to the hotel. We tried to listen to some music, but we were too late for that. Um, later on that evening, Mr. had, an, uh, had a, a, a mini stroke. We had to call 911 to the house, to the hotel. And so the thing is, it takes a long time for me to actually go to sleep. I think that if I was not asleep, I would not have heard him. So that was that. After that, the next, the following day, we went out to breakfast, we went to Waffle House, and then we went to the aquarium. I've never gone to the aquarium before. I had the most amazing time. And there's this little boy, he must have been like two or three, and he saw the dolphins pass right in front of him, and he just squealed, he's like, ah! He was so happy and excited. That's how I felt. And I told Nikki, I said, you know what? How come, when did it stop for us uh, as adults to not be excited and happy and actually show your excitement and happiness for something? And I was like, hmm. If I were to do, have done that, people would have looked at me like I was crazy, like I was absolutely nuts. So I'm gonna insert some pictures, so you'll see some pictures. And then, after that, we parted ways. And I had no idea that I was going to start missing her as fast as I did. So I get in the car. I'm trying not to tear up. I get in the car, and I check my phone. And the only reason why I check my phone is because I had to charge it. 
So I checked my phone and she had already sent me a text message. And I was like, dang. And I just lost it. I was just boo-hooing, boo-hooing like a little baby, like a little baby. Such a good friend, such a sweet, sweet person. And I really appreciate her. And I know so many of us who are in her life can appreciate her. Her, Because she, she'll she tell you that she loves you. You know, not many people will say, they'll say love you or they won't say I. You know, be more personal. She'll tell you that. She will definitely tell you that. So that is something that I can really appreciate eight, you know, her about um, showing love for a person. I really do appreciate that. So the following day, Sunday, I was worn out. I hadn't slept for like two days. I was, oh my God, you guys, I was so, so, so tired, so tired, so sleepy. So I slept. I waited until I was gonna take a nap when I got home, but I said, you know what, let me stay up and that way when it's time for me to go to sleep, I can just sleep. And even though the trip was only maybe two, maybe like two hours away, it was stop and go traffic and it it it, it wore on me, I guess. It wore on me. But anyway, yeah, that's that's my week in a nutshell. And um yeah, so what I'm trying to do is um, make an entire video of my trip to the aquarium. <sighs> it's not going easy because I have a lot of little clips and then pictures I want to insert. So hopefully um, I'll get that up, you know, up and running soon. But yeah, that's it. That's all, you guys. That's it for what's happened to me for the past week. If I can get the words out. Um, this weekend, I plan to just do some soaping and what else? Washing. That's about it. Nothing special today or tomorrow or Sunday. And then go to work next week. All right. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. You guys have a great weekend. about this Nikki I like it I like you it like a lot it? you like it you like <laughs> it a lot I like it a lot <laughs>